special remembrance is underway right now for teacher and coach Scott Beagle. He died saving the lives of his students. Chopper 4 is live over Parkland where runners from around the country are gathered for what they're calling the Run for Beagle. And CBS 4's Hank Tester joins us live from Pine Trails Park with more. Hank? Well, I can tell you the run was over with. They gathered for a memorial, and when the memorial broke up, they started running again in memory of the coach, the coach who died along with 16 others at Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School. There was a huge turnout for the run. Let's take a look. Everything's for him now. Every race that we do, it's for Coach Beagle. And run they did, a fitting memorial for a cross-country coach. Runners from the area and the coach's cross-country team dedicating this afternoon's special run to Scott Beagle. We need a change, and so everyone, we want everyone united out here to just be together and think about all the victims as well as the need for a reform and the gun policies. Scott Beagle was the cross-country coach at Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School. He gave his life protecting a classroom full of students as Nicholas Cruz shot his way through the school's hallways and classrooms. Beagle was a geography teacher who graduated from the University of Miami. At age 35, he was about to be married, lived in Deerfield Beach. Looking forward to having more seasons with him, and it's just really tragic. Like, we can't believe that now we don't have him anymore. The students in this run say, that Coach Beagle was new to coaching cross country. They knew he was learning on the job, but the one thing he really taught him and taught him well was run with your heart. Let's take a look at all this from Chopper 4. It's a large park here, and uh, this is a park where the uh, 17 Angels are uh, on the uh, on the stand here. And uh, you can see that the there's two kind of major areas, one where the memorial was, and then you're going to see the runners running around the park. Uh, it's something I think that they just really don't want to give up doing right now because they really did love this coach. And I have to tell you, to a student, as we talk to them about the coach, they always finished up reminding us that this is all about the coach and also about some type of gun legislation. These kids are lasered in on this. That's the very latest. I'm Hank Tester, CBS4. Back to you. They certainly are, Hank. Thank you for that. Still ahead at